Well, South Bend had millions of pairs of eyes on the city today. Social media giant Mark Zuckerberg was in town, and he live-streamed his surprise visit on Facebook alongside South Bend Mayor Pete Buttigieg. WSBT 22's Hillary Powell was there, and Hillary, this was Zuckerberg's first stop in his trip to the Hoosier State. That's right, Diane. South Bend got a starring role in two Facebook Live videos posted to Facebook CEO Mark Zuckerberg's Facebook page today. It's part of his nationwide tour this year to visit states he has yet to see. And the locals gave him a Hoosier welcome. Pulling up to the coffee shop. Uh, yeah, we'll be getting out in a second. I'm excited to show you this coffee shop. A Saturday drive with a friend around South Bend, but this ride is rare. Riding shotgun, Facebook founder Mark Zuckerberg rolling with Mayor Pete Buttigieg. We're getting some good comments, by the way. Yep. Um, Casey Sullivan, hi from Canada. And it was all live streamed to millions. Before we, we get into anything, Pete's going to give us a bit of a tour of the, the city here. Uh, Pete, do you want to just give give a bit about your, your background and how you got into being the mayor here? And uh, You have a pretty amazing story. Sure. I don't know about amazing, but... Uh, no, you have uh, an amazing story. So I grew up here in South Bend. In fact, we're, we're a few blocks from, from my boyhood home now. The first stop, the local cup coffee shop on the near northwest side where Zuckerberg shared a cup of joe with strangers at the Pay It Forward community business. As a mayor, you're, you're proud of your city, and, and uh, I could uh, spend all week showing somebody around South Bend. So I wanted him to see a real mix. I wanted him to see neighborhoods. Uh, I took him through downtown so we could see what we were up to with our smart streets. Uh, I wanted him to see... Uh, uh, what was going on with technology and uh, taking you know old buildings and giving them new futures. It's a Chase Tower. A quick pass by the old Chase Tower and it was on to an old Studebaker factory to get a sense of South Bend history. It was a ride along with two friends who went to college at Harvard at the same time. The chat got personal, touching on the mayor's political perspective. What do you think we need to do to get more folks like you to, to run for uh, to mayor and and state legislature. And well, the good news is I think more people are motivated to do that than before. The man known for connecting people online also got face to face with people behind the doors at the Juvenile Justice Center. Hoosier stopped to snap the man who knows a thing or two about going viral. I'm glad he came out here. This, this city needs more, more, you know, attention. You know, my hope is that there are a lot more people around the world who know a little bit about our city and hopefully understand why we're so proud of South Bend's story. <laughs> Looks like they had a good time, Diane. At last check, the video posted, the first one they took, has close to 2 million views. We have a link to that on our WSVT 22 mobile app.